What's up, party people? Android Stud here, and you got your new Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra or S24 Plus or S24, and you don't know how to power this off. I'm gonna show you how to do it. Because for some reason, I'm gonna show you how to do it the way that Samsung should give it to you out of the box. Because when they give it out give it to you out of the box, when you hit the power button here on the side, you get Bixby. No, that's not what we want what we want. I'm gonna show you how to set up your power button. So you can simply push it and it'll give you the power off option or reset option or it won't give you Bixby anymore. You can use Bixby to power off. You simply go, hi Bixby, power off device. Are you sure? So okay. you could do it that way. <laughs> you could do it that way, but I'm going to show you how to set it up. The way to set it up is there are a couple different ways that you can go to the side button settings. So. One of the other ones is just go down on your notification here, hit the power button right there. It's next to the settings icon. You go there and boom, you can power off your device. You can restart it, emergency call, medical info. And then you have this here, side button settings here on the bottom. You go into that and then you're gonna be able to simply set it up. You see how it's on wait Bexby? You simply put it on power off menu. And you have other options there if you want to do a double press to open up another app. You could do all kinds of apps here, um, select for the menu, or you could do a quick launch camera, which is actually a pretty good one to use. Now, as we go back and we hit our power button, guess what? We have a power off option, a restart, emergency call, all the good stuff. The other thing here is it shows you here that you can do it on the quick panel like I just showed you. You can use uh, Bixby or you can use the side and volume buttons. So you're simply gonna hit power button and power down and there you get the power option to shut off your device. Now, like I said, if you wanna set up your quick launch for double press, you simply double press and there's your camera. Or you can do another option if you go back in here into your side button settings and you can hit the clock. I have a set to a clock. So when I hit double press, I get my menu, my alarms, my stopwatch, whatever I want to do there. Now, if you don't want to do it in the quick panel, you could simply go into your settings, go to advanced features right here, and you're going to see side button menu there. And there you go. You have all your, you could go back to Bixby. You could do the power off menu, whatever you want to do. You, it's very, very simple. Now I know a lot of people go crazy when they find this video and they're so thankful and I appreciate you guys watching. That's why I'm here. I want to show you guys how to use your device. I don't know why Samsung, Apple, Google, so many different manufacturers simply don't do a power button option when it comes out of the box. They all set it to the assistant, whether it's Google, whether it's Bixby, whether it's Siri for Apple, whatever it may be, but it's kind of ridiculous. But that's why I made this video so you guys know how to shut off your device or power your device or power off your Samsung device, whatever it may be. But I appreciate you guys watching. Thanks so much. I'll have more videos on the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. So stay tuned. Thanks so much for watching. You're watching YouTube.